Hello boys and girls, remember me? I'm Big Al, Albert Einstein. So what are we doing today? Well, today we're going to travel around the world to visit tropical rainforests. And then Captain Callus is going to show you some interesting animals that live in these places. But first, what is the name of your planet? What's this planet called? Because you'll have to know this planet very well because we're going to go from the Amazon rainforest in South America, then we're going to Africa, then we're going to Asia and off to Australia. And then Captain Callus is going to take you back to North America to visit the Temperate Rainforest. All right? But first, we're going to the tropics. We're going to listen to the animal sounds. So make sure you listen very, very carefully and try to guess what kind of animals are talking to you, okay? So we'll see you later, boys and girls. So today, we're going to the tropical rainforest. So I want you to practice your listening skills. Everybody listen to this. So the first destination on our voyage today is to the Amazon rainforest. Now I'm going to show you some animals that live there, but I won't tell you what they are. I want you to guess what they are by the clues I'm going to give you, all right? Now the first animal, he's considered one of the slowest animals in the world. He lives up in the treetops. He rarely comes down from the trees. And when he does come down, you know what he has to do? He has to go to the bathroom. And this animal moves so slowly, plants actually grow on his furry body. And He's a plant eater. Have you guessed who that is? One of the slowest animals in the world lives in the Amazon rainforest. There he is, boys and girls. You know what this is? They hide to a sloth. Hello, boys and girls. How's it going? Nice to see you. Okay, our next animal. This animal is named after what it eats. It lives in the Amazon rainforest. It eats insects like termites and ants. This is an anteater. Say hi to the anteater. Now the Amazon rainforest is fa famous for lots of amphibians, like this one. Do you know who this is? This is a tree frog. It's got special, special feet so he can climb trees. He hides up there, looks for food, and uses green for camouflage. That's a tree frog. And of course, tree frogs have to watch out for Snakes, like the boa. Now, our next destination is Africa. So we're gonna go to Africa. Now, I want you to put on your listening devices and take a listen. Tell me what animals you hear, okay? What's this? Guess what animals we heard, boys and girls? So we're in Africa. So we heard two of the most famous animals from Africa. The elephant and the But now we're going to the tropical rainforest in Africa to see one of the most amazing animals. This animal likes to pound his chest. He's famous. I guess he misses. Is. You know who that is, boys and girls? Gorillas. Okay, before we leave Africa, we're going to a very special island. Just off of Africa is a special island called Madagascar. It's the home of one of my friends here. Do you know who lives in Madagascar? Let's introduce some of the animals that live there. Here's one of the most famous. This is a ring-tailed lemur. Tail. Related to monkeys. A beautiful animal. And Madagascar has some of the most amazing chameleons and different kinds of lizards. And of course, there's different kinds of frogs there. And different kinds of snakes. Now, after our trip to Madagascar, it's time to go to Asia's rainforest. Asia. 
Do you recognize that animal? That's a gibbon. A gibbon is like a big monkey that was ages when he first. And we're going to Australia now. So guess where we are now? We're in the Australian rainforest. And we're hearing a kookaburra bird. I'll show you a kookaburra. See boys and girls? That's a kookaburra. And there's lots of lizards in the rainforest, lots of beautiful birds. Now, we're going to visit an animal that's really interesting, boys and girls. This animal is related to the platypus. Now, platypus and this animal, the mommy does something very special. They're both mammals, but the mommy lays an egg like a bird. And when the egg hatches, guess what happens? When the egg hatches, a little animal comes out of the egg, and the mommy has to feed the animal milk. So the echidna is a mammal, even though the mommy lays an egg. She's related to the platypus, who also lays eggs. So there's some of the animals that live in the rainforest around the world. So we went to the Amazon, we saw anteaters and sloths, and tree frogs, and boas. We went to Madagascar to see the lemur. We met the echidna. We heard frogs in the rainforest. And we saw lots of snakes, of course, floating around the rainforest. We'll say goodbye to one of the animals we saw in the African rainforest. Get a closer look at it. This is a scanimation book. So as I move the book, the animal will start to move. Okay. Thanks, boys and girls. Thanks for coming along on our trip to the Trump of the Rainforest. And now we're going to go back to the temperate rainforest of North America. Audio Jungle.